Hello, my YouTube family. It is rather early. It is 8, 10 in the morning, and I'm getting ready to go to work. But I had, had, had to make this little short video. I'll go, I'm going to be making one tonight. As you can see, I don't have my lips on. I did that specifically. Don't want to give everything away. Okay. Um, I just wanted to thank my YouTube family. Oh, sweet Jesus. I have the best YouTube family in the world. This is pertaining to yesterday's video. And I just want to say I had comments all great, all fantastic. Oh, my goodness. You guys can teach an old dog new tricks. Let me just let me just put it that way. Devin, I, I really have to I have to shout you out. I have to shout you out because first of all, yours was the very first comment that I read. And you started with a sigh. And I know it came from the heart. I mean, literally, people, read Devin's comment to me. It's rather lengthy, and my response is rather lengthy to her as well. But she started with a sigh, and I know it came from her heart. And then I started to read, and I started to read, and I started to read. And you made, girl, you made such valid points. It's not, it's not even funny. And then I'm reading other comments, and they're similar points. And I'm going, okay, well, there's no right and wrong about the way we are thinking. There are just different ways that the way we think. And I think I've opened your eyes to the way I think, and I, and you guys have definitely opened my eyes to the way you think and it is a generational thing it is a generational thing i have to admit it's a generational thing and your generation not a, not everybody in your generation but the, my youtube family okay your generation is smart witty intelligent just you, you've you opened my eyes to another side of seeing this situation. And I can't thank you enough. So this is, I mean, I woke up feeling like I've got something to say. I've got something to say. And I've got to tell all of my family. I've got to tell you all. I really do. I just, I just had to. Yes. Yes. I did spend a lot of time thinking, talking about this whole, you know, Ky apparently it's called the Kylie Jenner lip challenge or just the Kylie Jenner challenge. Spent a lot of time thinking that it was a race thing. And this is how I saw it from my point of view, a generational thing. Race, nah, I'm a 60s baby, okay? So, so yeah, it's, it's, it's ingrown in me, but... Here's the difference. There are certain people in my generation who will refuse to change and try to widen their horizons and think other ways. My parents taught me differently. Always keep your mind open to other aspects of thinking about one particular subject or all particular subjects. There's a black and white side, not, not trying to be funny, but there's a black and white side to everything. There's always another side to the coin. So I gave you my point of view and, and obviously I, I felt very strongly about it because I was supposed to be supposed to be talking about Real Housewives and I wound up going off on this tangent. But when I read your comments and I said, and I read them this morning, I read them this morning. I didn't read them last night, read them this morning. And I just said, okay, you know, okay. I woke up remembering what I had said in my video. And I, 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 apparently it, it obviously struck a chord in me because if I'm going to sleep still thinking about it, it's obviously something weighing heavily on my head. And then I woke up thinking, okay, you know what? It, it's not good. I can't shake it. But then I started to read your comments, all of your comments. And I'm, I'm sure I haven't read everybody's. I'm sure there's probably still more to come and I'll probably answer them while I'm at work. But... I started to see your side of it. And Nancy, it is not always a race thing. It's not always a race thing. Sometimes it can be, but it's not always a race thing. I didn't choose to see it as a race thing. That's how I felt. 
And that's where I was coming from. You guys widened my horizons, broadened them even more, and said, it's really not a black and white thing. It's, it's a trend. It's a fad. It's what's happening today. And it'll be gone before next year. And you're so right about that. I have to remember what it is like to be a teenager and who I admired and who I wanted to be. But I also have to remember that it's not a white chick thing because let's flip it. Let's flip it. And I have to remember this because this was how I grew up. When I used to relax my hair all the time, which I still do, <laughs> that's not going to stop. There were a lot of my friends, you know, in high school or in high school, basically not in, not in, um, excuse me, not my nose is starting to run. I guess I'm getting that emotional in high school. You know, there were, there were, you know, the whole old natural thing has always been, there were always girls who were like, well, why are you relaxing your hair? Why are you doing the, the, you know, the, the. You relax a crack kind of a thing. And I'm like, because I like it. No, it's because you want to be white. You want to be like a white girl. So it's always going, there's always going to be something. Today is Kylie Jenner. But then when you flip the script to black girls, what's up with everybody having extensions? And what's up with all of that? So it's, it's I, I chose to, because I chose the Kylie Jenner topic, but you could take it on any topic. And it is not always a black and white thing. Maybe black girls like to wear extensions uh, because they like to wear extensions. Maybe they want longer hair than the, it's not because they want to be white. I don't relax my hair because I want to be white. <laughs> like you can wish upon a store all you want to, Nancy. That's just not going to happen unless I choose to go. With, what is that baseball player who was Cuban, I think he, he came from Cuba and he was dark and then he really, I mean, he whitened his skin. I guess that's what he wanted to be. That is not the avenue I'm taking, choose to take, even think about taking. I like my skin color. Thank you very much. And black don't crack and I don't have no wrinkles. So I'm very, very proud about that. So just to sum it all up, I just want, this is a message of thank you. This is a thank you to my YouTube family for opening up my eyes, all four of them, to seeing that it's not always about a race thing. It, it really isn't, Nancy. It's just a thing. Okay. Okay. Now, this is not to say that you have changed my mind, but you've made me see another side to it. So... What is he doing? I'm trying to be serious, and this is this is what I have in, in the background. Do, do you see what he's doing to my shades? Because it's sunny outside, and the birds are out there, and this is my plight, people. I'm, try, I'm trying to talk about a serious topic, and this is what's going on behind me. Just to sum it up, I just want to thank you. Thank you for making me see another side to the situation. Not the situation, to the topic. It's not a situation. I don't have kids. It's not a situation for me. It's not. It, it is what it is. The world will always continue to, to, to go around. There will always be boy bands that girls go crazy over. You know, it's, it's, it's a growing up thing. It's a phase. It's a fad. I just don't want anybody to get hurt in this fade and, and trend thing. And some girls are, and, and I'm that that's my concern also. You know, trends are supposed to be fun. They're supposed to be whimsical. They're supposed to be, yeah, okay, let's just do this for now because it's the end thing to do. But the end thing to do right now is 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 kind of painful. And it is what it is. That I'm just going to leave it at that. It is what it is. I may see it differently, but I also see it your way. And I'm glad I, I see it your way because I get to see it a different way. 
Nobody's right. Nobody's wrong. It's just a different way of thinking. And as you can see, the sun is coming in and out. It's going to be one of those kind of days. So I don't know what time it is now. I don't want to be late. It's 820. I'm going to be late. I'm going to just sum this up as a thank you to everybody who commented and who continues to comment. And maybe and even those who just chose to just say, nice lip gloss, Nancy. <laughs> it just didn't take a side one way or the other. I, I respect each and every one of you and thank you oh, this is this is the biggest thank you thank you for not making it an anger thing thank you for commenting maturely we don't have to we don't have to get into an argument over it it's i have my side you have your side it's called a discussion it's called a debate a discussion whatever you want to call it but it's a mature one you have made me see your side and I am seeing and, and, and I hope you saw my side. And yes, Devin, I do have to admit it is a generational. I'm old school, girl. I'm old. I'm old school. So you can understand where I'm coming from. But you're bringing me along to now. You're bringing me along to your generation. It's not there. There are some, you know, old schoolers generation before me, my parents' generation, who are stuck in their ways and that's the way it is and that's the way it should have always been and mm -mm, I'm not that. I, I, I've i progressed from that generation to my generation, but I'm still progressing. You are bringing me into your generation. I've tried to bring my parents into my generation and that didn't work so good a lot, but they did the best that they could and I understand it. I get it. I get it. Like my father, you know, he still doesn't understand how a computer works. He doesn't understand how to turn one on. He, it's just a thing. And I have tried to teach him and he just doesn't want to. So this is what I'm saying. I am, I, I'm not that stubborn. I'm trying to remain open-minded for as long as I can. I'm trying to remain, I'm still looking for my 16 year old glow. Okay. So let's not even, I am trying to continue to grow and you guys are helping me do that. And I appreciate you, I appreciate you, and I appreciate you. I just want you to know that, okay? So before I become any later to get to work, I have to be at work at 9, people. It's 8.20. It's a little later now. What time is it now? 8.22? Okay, so I'm going to just wrap this up. And I will see you guys again tonight after work to do my lips of the day. But I didn't want to... to I didn't want to mix the two together because I really felt strongly and I wanted to say something bright and early while it's still fresh in my head. So I just want to thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for broadening my horizons. Because I'm always talking about everybody should broaden their horizons. Well, that includes you too, Nancy. And you are doing just that. I am seeing your side and it's not always a race thing. Nancy, just it is what it is. So just move on. Don't let it don't let it get to you. Don't let it get to your goat. Don't let it stick on your throat. Whatever the case is, it is what it is. Youth will always be youth. Youth will do stupid things. I have done my fair share. Lord only knows. And it is what it is. I just don't want people getting hurt in the situation. That's that's really what pricks me. But other than that, you know, let's just keep it right and light. Just keep it right and light. So once again, I'm just going to close up now. I'm going to say thank you once again. My YouTube family is the ish. Okay, just letting you know, just letting you all know. So everybody read everybody else's comments and see my responses. And you'll, you'll understand this is, this is a topic. It's an issue for today, but it's really not that serious as Devin told me. So Devin, you have, you're, you are the leader on this one. Okay. You are the leader on this one. And I am glad that you are. And I'm glad that you're part of my YouTube family. I love you very much. Not just you, but you know my entire family. But you're the pinnacle on, on, on this particular video. Okay, you're the pinnacle. Because you're the very first comment that I read. And, and you expressed yourself so generously and so very well. And thank you, thank you, thank you. So I'm going to talk to you guys later on today. Let's just hope that this day is a fast one. Because... Let's just hope I can have my 2.30 lunch, okay? My, my 2 o'clock to 2.30 lunch as opposed to an earlier lunch to make this day go longer. No, 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 no. 
let, let, let's keep it the way it is, okay? You know I'll have things to talk about when I get back from back from work. And I'll see you guys later on. I love you. All of you have a fantastic day. And I will talk to you later. I love you. Bye now.